And funding is on the way to help fight the opioid epidemic in Yuma County. Reporter Eduardo Morales shares more and where the money is coming from and just how much. The Yuma County will be receiving an estimated 2% of the Arizona Opioid Settlement Fund allocated to Arizona counties. The state of Arizona, along with other states, um, decided to do something about the opioid epidemic and hold the people that are responsible for distributing some of these opioids or perhaps not educating the public about the addictive potential of these opioids accountable. In the settlement, companies such as Walgreens, CVS, and Purdue Pharma will be forced to pay an estimated $46.2 billion. The money from the settlement would help funding for organizations such as community medical services. Even with medical conditions sometimes, they, they can't have one um, medication as an option, so having those different options would help us serve a larger population um, for opioid use with those people who are in need. However, organizations like community medical services and the Yuma County as a whole may have to wait a little longer for the funding. So some of those entities might provide payments over five years, some of them over 10 years, and some of them might spread those payments over 18 years. So the funding amount is gonna vary per year, and it's not consistent. So it's not a guaranteed amount every year. While the exact amount is not known, it is estimated that the Yuma County will receive just under $13 million. Reporting in studio, Eduardo Morales, 13 on your side. Thank you, Eduardo.